This ain't a normal video. Done. Where I need a video now. Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. So as you can tell by the title of the video, we are gonna be making a honey garlic lemon, honey garlic lemon pepper chicken. And I did ask y'all like about a month ago if y'all would want me to make the recipe for y'all. So finally a month later. This is not my recipe by the way. I found it on TikTok. I'll link the person in the description to let you know it's not my recipe. But also he does use um chicken thighs instead of chicken breast, but either way the this still tastes pretty good, but I guess if you want like a juicier flavor, get chicken thighs. We're making it with uh, white rice and also steamed veggies. So the sides are all honestly just up to you. Let's get started now. I do have five chickens here, but I'm going to cut them in half. Just our pref just my preference just to do it, but if you want to have it as a whole chicken, that's totally fine. So let's cut the chickens now. Put it in half, slice it up to you, like I said. I know I did ask y'all like a month, almost two months ago, if y'all wanted me to make another chicken recipe, and that is going to also be it's in the process right now. It's just saying to y'all that I was in school and this semester it really I mentally just so much this semester so that's another reason why i haven't i've done a lot more vlogs so i feel like those are more easier to do in a way but cooking ones mm, i haven't really been i haven't i didn't really have the time to do like a cooking video but i'm out of school i school for almost like a month already so y'all let me know what y'all want to see any ideas like i mentioned in my other vlogs I will be traveling this summer. I'm excited for that. So make sure y'all subscribe, click the notification bell so y'all notified whenever those videos upload. So now we have the chickens here and we're gonna get a bowl and then we're gonna put lemon pepper, smoked paprika, garlic salt, garlic salt, gar garlic, salt, pepper. So this one, the thing with this one is that it is like more thicker compared to the other pepper where it's more fine so it's up to you if you want to do that this is that we're, not, we're gonna like slowly see how it is because we don't want to like so like crunchy either so we're just gonna put I think like this amount and got soap put the lemon pepper in here oh then also it is it, the recipe did say you have to marinate it for a few hours so it's currently 253 we're gonna start cooking like four or five-ish. So that's another reason, that's another thing to keep in mind when you're gonna make this, to marinate it. Obviously the longer you marinate it, the, uh, the more flavor will be. The first time I did make it, I only did for an hour, but I mean, it still came out good. So this time we have a little bit more time to see if the marinating does make a difference. So we're gonna put, put um, we already put my pepper. Should, should I just put all of it? It's like that much. Let's put all of it. We're gonna put Put the garlic. Oh, that a bit too much. I don't know. Salt. And we're gonna put the pepper. Do you see how the the pepper is a little thicker compared to the other one? So I'm gonna keep it like that. And we're gonna be adding avocado oil. You guys, my glasses just broke right now. They're already getting loose right after the clip. So right now, it freaking broke. Some of you freaking blind. Huh? I'm not that blind, I can see stuff, so. Zillo, send me new glasses. I know what I'm saying. We are gonna be using avocado oil. I believe he does put, I think he said vegetable oil or olive oil. One of those oils in his mixture, but we're gonna be using avocado oil. So, let's it in mix it to like thick so you want it to be like a little bit more runny in a way oh i forgot to put the paprika that's what i was like why does it look red like why does it look like that <coughs> it did so paprika doesn't really give it like a spice but my neighbor's dogs it doesn't really give it a spice. I guess if you want like spicy, I'm not getting water. 
If you want it spicy, obviously just add like cayenne or any other chile or any other thing you want. You know the other time, I made it like really, really red. I was like, oh shit, I'm gonna go in the toilet. I think like that. And I don't really know like the measurements and the video he doesn't really explain. So just eyeball it. Part will tell you when to stop, when to add more. I don't really cook that much, you know? But from what I have cooked before, eyeball it and do what your heart desires. I do the same thing because like when I bake, so, like it's like basically the same thing, right? Almost the same thing. I shouldn't say basically. Okay, we're gonna keep it like this. Do y'all see it? That's good. Now we're gonna do like a little taste test. If you want to taste it, it's You have like that hint, like a slight hint of like um the paprika and the spice, but I feel like you taste the garlic more. But once you put everything together, it's gonna taste, especially with the lemon. The lemon's gonna really that and the honey. Oh, y'all gonna see right now, okay? I'm getting too ahead of myself, but it's gonna be good. I'm gonna marinate the chicken now with this mixture. It is very good to use it like how I did it. Because the mirror, you know, everything's gonna be going on the bottom. Oh, you see, like some of the juices are flowing. Oh, you see, that's like one thing I like about this because you get that texture on the chicken. Your hands are going to get dirty with this. So if you don't want your hands to be dirty, I don't know what to tell you. Now that the chickens are marinated, I'm gonna set it to the side and let it sit for about mm, an hour or two. Now that the chicken's out, we're gonna put it in the oven for 400, but we're gonna put it for 30 minutes. And then once that 30 minutes is over, we're gonna put it again for another 20 minutes. So, okay, so we're gonna put it. Now that that's in the oven, we're gonna start making the sauce. I turned it on. Okay, so what do you put? He put butter, so we're gonna put, or he cut the butter. We're gonna put the butter on his spatula. <laughs> we're gonna get the butter and then, did he say for it to boil or put it all together? You gotta <laughs> let it melt and then I don't know if you had what? what the saying. garlic? I think he, yeah. Oh, I the forgot. Garlic's over here. Well, all you gotta do is just put it on this. Here. Two seconds later. Like I said, he didn't really give measurements, so I'm just eyeballing it. So, so we're gonna mix that in. Wow. Okay. And then, so mm -hmm. now we're gonna add soy sauce. Whatever we feel like doing. Soy sauce. Oh, I forgot to get lemon juice. It's fine. It's fine. Get the lemon. Water. And then let me go get the lemon because I forgot about that. Big lemons are from Costco. They're like huge. And the cutting boards from Costco. Too. Oh yeah, the, not sponsored by Costco, <laughs> but maybe one day sponsored no, by Costco. Yep. <laughs> Why not? Costco, everything is sponsored. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We gotta do a Costco run so Costco can see us. Chickens that I put, I put 
could just cut the rest of that and that should be fine. You have to put them all of them. We're gonna let the, oh, should I should put a pie on like wire in it? when after the 20 minutes right because i have to because the thing is that it's gonna be in there for 30 minutes and then i have to do it for another 20 minutes when it's done but once it's out i'm gonna marinate it wait what did you say to do <laughs> we're gonna put it in there for 30 minutes on one side and flip it for another 20 on the other side and then once that 20 is over we're gonna marinate it put it in there for i think we did like 10 15 minutes last yeah. time and then once I put the sauce and everything in there, that's what you I'm do the rest. Oh, okay. Okay. okay we that's got it. gonna happen. Have about like another hour until we do that. But it's gonna go by fast. Like it's it's easy to make. It's just time yeah. consuming. So yeah, see ya when the chicken's out. Now the chicken is all. I mean, it's not fully done, but. Okay, now we're gonna flip it to the other side. We're gonna put butter with the veggies. I already did salt and pepper and a little bit of oil, so that's why I'm gonna go ahead with the butter. A little bit too much butter. Okay. What is that for? The veggies. But like this will be fine for the rice too. Okay. Okay, we're gonna wait for it to melt and then I'll show y'all when everything starts cooking all together. Okay, time to take it out. Woo! We're gonna put the sauce on top of here. It looks burnt, but it's not burnt. Oh, it's so small. Just flipped the other side to do both sides, and then we're gonna be adding. Ooh, oh my lord. Okay, we're gonna be adding the lemons on top of the chicken. Like this. Oh! <laughs> Not small chicken, it's a big old lemon. This chicken for sure is. Okay, we'll do two lemons. Okay, I think I'm gonna switch this one to over here. Oh look, it looks like a heart. It's so cute. We're gonna put it in the oven for uh, 10 more minutes. And then we're gonna make, well, I already did the veggies, but I'm, I already did the veggies, but I'm just, I turned it off because I didn't want it to get too toasted and then all cold when the chicken comes out. So I'm gonna turn it back on, I'm gonna turn it back on to make it nice and warm. And the rice, the rice should be done already, so I'm gonna check on it right now. We do add butter because it just makes it like a better flavor, softer flavor. 
So if y'all want butter, y'all should have butter to your price. Now that the food is out, this is how it came out. We're gonna cook into it. It literally barely came out, so hopefully I don't burn my tongue. Like last time I put, I don't know what I put, the seasoning didn't stay that much on like the last time, but everything came out good. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Let me know if y'all made the recipe, how it came out for y'all. I'll see y'all in the next video. Remember to like, comment, subscribe. Bye.